DJ Battle Cat is a legendary hip hop producer from South Central California who was one of the most prolific West Coast producers of the late 80s and 90s. DJ Battle Cat broke in as a 16 year old DJ in the early K Day era and remains one of the most influential architects of West Coast rap. Dr. Dre also told him about Tom's signature and bars. This was when Dre was leaving the form NWA. He came back in the studio to grab some turntables when he saw Battle Cat having trouble with trying to sequence a drum machine. DJ Battle Cat's go-to machine was the SP-1200. You can see it in the studio here. His second go-to machine is the MPC-3000. You can see it in the studio here. The MPC-3000 is still one hell of a drum machine even after 25 years. He also used the MPC-62. You can hear him talk about it here. I had the MPC-60. Two and I had the MP60. Uh, yeah, I said the MP60 too. Now, now when you're looking at it, it's the first hardware uh, uh, controller, software hardware controller, the one you just got through looking at. But that 3000 is where I start making the history of Battle Cat on a whole nother level. Like the Ghetto Jam, the first album I ever produced. My first sophomore debut album was Domino from Long Beach, so I used the SP-1200 and the MP-62. He also used the MPC Live. You can see it here in this video. As far as controllers, Battle Cat used the Native Instruments Complete Control X61. You can see it here in this video. DJ Battle Cat is one of the West Coast's most influential hip-hop producers. He produced for Tupac, Snoop Dogg, Nate Dogg, and Spice One. Shoutouts to Doom Tapes, DJ Word, TBS Drink Team, and AJVY for recommending Battle Cat. If you have a producer that I haven't done yet, put it in the comment section below. If you are interested in any of the equipment I spoke about in this video, I have included a link to it in the description below. Thanks for watching.